Okay. There's a very, very simple rule for building engagement, and that is systemically move away. Systemically move away, not towards the dog. So this dog is all over me. <laughs> he believes that I'm going to go away, though. He believes I'm going to go away. And I am going to go away. That's what he thinks it. So you got to be delighted by things if you're, yes, yes, yeah. I don't even say the word yes, but you got to be delighted. The dog should write itself to face the handler automatically. like his feet. Oh. So that's a one my little subtask. Jumping up is one little subtask. Oh. So I, I, he's saying to himself, okay. The other step did not work, but Anyway, super cute dog. All right, let me get, oh, you know what he was doing? He, he's so intent on delivering. There was nothing to pick up, so he picked up this bowl. So what should, I should probably, if I really wanted to do that, I'm going to get a smaller bowl. Hang on. keep his eye on me all the time. All right, so he's got a super cute leash delivery. Oh, hi, Jeff. Yeah, get that horse for me. 
If he said you need to ride a six, yes, the horse has to be like 16. If he said, do we have, yes, we have to lunge it in the round pen for two hours. If he said, because you don't know how to ride, no, because I do know how to ride. <laughs> Smart enough to know. Okay. Anyway, he took that upon himself. <laughs> but people need to write that down. Oh, oh, hi, uh, uh, hi, Doreen. I just, I just did uh, videos and uh, a thing with Anka, and I th think you're gonna be a little surprised when you see how she was running game on this other dog. I'm gonna set it all in slow mo, though. But that is the very simple formula systemically move away if he said no when i meet a girl i just start texting them every two seconds and then i smother them and hover over them and then they say i love you 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 they say my god this guy is a stalker so it's it's the same thing it's it's uh, it's the nature of anything it's the thrill of the chase this that and the other so all right, so I can just set the basket right there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. God, he's cute. Okay, let me get rid of this real quick. All right, so... You want to do this leash delivery thing? It is is simple. It is simple. All you gotta do is get your leash. Doreen's like, that's my leash. I know it's your leash. You just tie the end in a knot, and there's a very specific reason because you don't want the dog grabbing it at the end all the time. All right, you might you do want to grab it at the end. So I'm very specific about how I put the leash on too. And I am hooking it to this electronic collar. Uh-oh. If you said they figure out how to get their foot out, absolutely. They absolutely, I, I just did it with Anka too. They figure out how to get their foot out from underneath it. We're not talking rocket science, people. I do like to say, uh oh. Ah! To do it over here, I did. Why won't it stay tight in a knot? I don't know. Uh oh. Ah! You saw him figure out just foot, though. I see him looking at me. I don't always look back. I don't always look back. Uh-oh. Ah! Anyway. All right, now I can do the basket thing. Anyway, I can do the basket drill, and I, if you said, because it's going to remember from yesterday, if you set things up a certain way, so if you said you need props, and absolutely, you need props, so if I set the drill up the same way I did yesterday, it should remember, if you said should, they could forget, <laughs> no, they can't, if you said what would make them forget, not enough precursors, just not enough precursors where you're just suddenly saying where you're suddenly just saying do something without a lot of presupposition and if you said what's well, it's a subconscious belief of what's going to happen next and if you said get it's honestly in some cases it's like a self-fulfilling prophecy subconsciously you believe that's what's going to happen next you go off the table okay I'm gonna do the empty basket. All right, hang on. All right. He started to 
go there. Uh, so I, I jockey around to this side. If you said, wouldn't have everything. Yes, he's a beginner, okay? Everything would have spilled out, hello? He said, why do you untie the leash? Because you don't want that snap hitting them if they're running with it. Anyway, that's the fun though. It's as hard as it is. Oh, no, he's an absolute monster. No, don't kid yourself. He's an absolute monster. Monster. Oh, thank God I got him neutered. I just told Dr. Castro. That was right before the hurricane. Oh, that was right when you guys came. She's like, oh, no. Oh, no, this hurricane. We better wait. Better wait. I said, hell with the hurricane. I need this dog neutered immediately. <laughs> she said she, so she forgot about the hurricane and neutered the dog. All right, be right back.